In a bizarre and audacious move, Senjizo Chibangu, self-appointed Secretary General of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, has made headlines by claiming ownership of advocate Nelson Chamisa's face. Chibangu's assertion has sent shockwaves through Zimbabwean politics, raising questions about intellectual property rights, party loyalty, and the limits of political maneuvering. The controversy erupted when Chibangu, in a display of apparent desperation, issued a stern warning to anyone who dares to use the logo bearing advocate Chamisa's face, asserting his authority within the CCC. Chibangu declared his readiness to pursue legal action against individuals or entities that utilize Chamisa's likeness without his consent. Let me set it clear that I'm one of the most influential decision-making board members of the CCC. The people who claim to have fired me had their sweet dreams, and they must be strongly warned against maliciously using the party logo as that will attract severe consequences. Chibanga claimed. Chibanga's bold declaration has not only reignited tensions within the CCC but has also drawn widespread skepticism and criticism from across the political spectrum. Many view his claim of ownership over Chamisa's face as absurd and legally dubious, raising concerns about the manipulation of party symbols for personal gain or political advantage. Moreover, Chibangu's assertion of authority within the CCC adds another layer of complexity to the already tumultuous landscape of Zimbabwean politics. His self-proclaimed position as a decision-making board member of the CCC challenges the legitimacy of the party's internal structures and further fuels internal divisions and power struggles. In response to Chibanga's claims, voices within the CCC have expressed skepticism and condemnation, questioning the motives behind his actions and calling for transparency and accountability within the party. Some have accused Shibangu of attempting to assert control over the CCC for personal gain or political manipulation, while others have urged unity and solidarity in the face of external pressures and challenges. Amidst the controversy, advocate Nelson Chamisa, the central figure at the heart of Chibanga's claims, has remained notably silent. His absence from the fray has only served to intensify speculation and uncertainty surrounding the situation leaving many to wonder about the implications for his leadership and the future direction of the CCC. As the dust settles on Chibanga's bold assertion of ownership over advocate Nelson Chamisa's face, Zimbabwean politics finds itself at a crossroads. The episode serves as a stark reminder of the complexities and challenges inherent in political mobilization and organization. Highlighting the need for transparency, accountability, and integrity within political parties. Ultimately, the fate of Chibanga's claim and its impact on the CCC and Zimbabwean politics at large remain uncertain. However, one thing is clear. The episode has ignited a fierce debate about the boundaries of political authority, the sanctity of party symbols, and the importance of principled leadership in navigating the turbulent waters of Zimbabwean politics.